Well, you don't have to take the bus, so you don't have to worry. You're just going to do a My name is Jack Simon. I grew up skiing Stratton Mountain, Vermont, the greatest mountain on earth. Uh, five days, well, day one is always flats, flats and drills. We do a lot of short swing turns. Uh, short swing turns, you're supposed to mimic your mogul turn. So all of your bad habits you have during your short swings are only exasperated in the moguls. So if we can get to them before we get into the bumps, then we can know what we're working with and what we, what we need to fix. Like the snow is really soft and uh, I feel really comfortable um, really pushing pushing my boundaries. For moguls especially, you get nice soft conditions. It's nice and warm. If you're jumping a whole lot, the landing is nice and soft, so you don't have to worry about taking a digger and getting a real bad injury. Uh, this week I was working on getting more tip pressure as I hit the mogul to get the tips faster over it. Um, keeping my knees together and my feet and just like kind of going more direct. So Jack's telling me to keep my elbows in because I'm getting like these chicken arms and I've been kind of slinging my back flips and I need to like hold it out more so I can actually get the tuck. This is a job well done. But now let's keep those knees together as you're doing it. I know it's a bit freakier, you're going faster, you're going harder, but we still have to have our fundamentals correct. Well, being able to look at video after your training is super important uh, because it's really hard to be able to understand what you're doing while you're doing it because you obviously can't see yourself. Um, you get to look at your turn, look at the way that you hit your takeoffs and do your tricks. We can look at the things we talked about that day and we can find new things that we didn't notice before. The video helps if you can just see what you're doing and see like what your coaches are telling you. Hey, you're too quick with your tuck on here as well. Wait until you see blue sky until you tuck. A trampoline gives us a basis for our tricks and an understanding of how they translate to snow. Shoulders are back behind here. Let's get them forward. Better. Is the music all synced up? It's on. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> we have three different jumps, three different abilities. One is a bigger booter that you won't really see in the moguls, but it's great for working new tricks. We got a, uh, a medium-sized jump. It's great for kids to learn spread eagles, 360s, stuff like that. And then we have one jump for beginners. One jump with a sloping landing um, with a flat top so you don't have to come off of it and feel like you're being yeeted to your back. And the jumps are super slushy and the landings are really nice. So even if you like land on your back, you're fine. What are you working on here today? Right now I'm working on my back flips and keeping my hips up and then tucking quickly and not tucking too early. What are you working on today? 360 with um, my platform. <laughs> um, I'm practicing my 360 right now. And how's that going? Uh, not well, <laughs> but I'm working on it. What's the hardest part about doing a three? Um, like <laughs> committing to it and like not getting scared. All ability levels can come here. Um, I've had kids who ski NORAMs, I've had ski kids who ski national championships, and I've had 40-year-old dads who just want to learn how to ski mogul better. All types are welcome here. Um, it's one of my favorite parts about the camp is that I can use all parts of my mogul knowledge and build someone from no knowledge, from no understanding of how to ski moguls, and build them to a comfort level where they can go and rock it with their boys on a trip. And then for those who ski nationals, I can help bring them to the next level. What can you tell me about Coach Jack? Uh, Coach Jack is a pretty silly guy, um, but he's pretty. He's good at. He's good at moguls. He's good at teaching. Teaching us. Uh, he makes the, He makes it fun on the mountain. Always. Also, if you're an accomplished competitive mogul skier, it's a great place to come and train and uh, meet new people and have a good time with your summer camp. The moguls are alive and well here at Hood and perhaps around the country. It's a fun camp because you get to come up here in the slush and work on things that you need to work on. We're all out here to have a good time. We're all going to improve and it's positive.
vibrations out here. It's really nice because it's it's just nice to come here in the summer because there's still snow and you can still ski during the summer. You learn a lot and there's a lot of like one-on-one -on -one time and it's worth it. Uh, I had a really great time this week. It was really fun. That it's an amazing place to learn skiing and they should definitely come try it out. I know, it's been really fun and I've gotten way better just from this one week. And I always get better here. It's really nice. I don't want to go home. <laughs> This is the only job I've ever had where I leave work happier than when I came in. And uh, that's why I love helping other people doing it. That's why I love doing it myself. That's why I get up at 5 a.m. every morning with a smile on my face and a Red Bull in my hand, ready to get after another one. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs>